What up, YouTube family? Welcome to Symbolic Mind Generation, SMG. Today, man, we got a very serious video today. I'm going to bring y'all two very, very serious videos today. It's an airplane flying over. I don't know if y'all can hear that, if it's, if it's muffling my sound. <clears throat> but uh, today's topic, man, is synthetic weed, better known as K2, better known as Spice, better known as Tunchi. This is a big problem in federal and state prisons across the United States. And I'm just going to tell you, if you know somebody in jail, they keep calling you and they tripping, you know what I mean? And, and lying, saying that the money didn't go through and they doing this. Can you resend it and all that? They own this shit right here. They own it. You know what I'm saying? They is on it. And, uh, and I'm going to tell you. It's not even weed that they getting high off of. I remember, man, I was locked up somewhere and they had raided a house. Right? And this dude didn't have nothing but over-the-counter stuff in his house. They couldn't even take him to jail. You know what I mean? So it's been some rumors that they've been, you know, you know, you can get the stuff in and, you know, you can get it in in the letter. Like a lot of jails won't even let you send postcards or that no more. You can't send nothing. Because they spray it on paper. But really, man, it ain't nothing. I heard it was like they misraved into the cockcocks. Raid, bro. And I'm gonna show you some videos. And I don't wanna I don't wanna disturb you if you got some people in jail. And I don't want these videos to disturb you or whatever. But uh, you know. This information needs to be known. If you're naive to what's really going on in there, you know what I'm saying? I done seen guys just get butt naked, come out to sell butt naked, walking around the unit, butt ass naked. You know what I mean? One dude was in there, they was in there getting, you know, hitting it, the K2 and the spice or whatever, and they was in the cell right by the door. And the door just pushed over, boom. Dude came out like a gorilla. Oh, who want it? Who want it? Right? CEO come like, what's going on? He ran over there and attacked the CEO. Out of his mind. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'm going to show y'all a couple of videos. They're very disturbing. But I don't want my people to get people in jail. I want y'all to know exactly what's going on in there. Check this out. Now listen, now listen, this dude basically turned retarded off of taking a hit. He basically turned retarded. You know what I mean? He basically turned retarded after taking a hit. Do you see that? This could be going on with your loved ones. I ain't done with y'all. I got something else for y'all. Check this out. Put 
Lord. You know what I'm saying? A damn snow angel on concrete. Lord have mercy. Y'all think I'm done with y'all? Y'all think I'm done with y'all? Huh? Check this out. Saw some of the guys in our video just beating themselves in the head. Uh, it's possible that a suicide that occurred down at one of our prisons. He jumped from a third floor. Uh, it's possible he was under the influence of K2. Man, listen. Man, listen. 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 This shit is the harder thing to get off of. People was coming home. And I'm gonna tell y'all something, right? I think this stuff right here is permanently damaging your loved ones if they are on this. And it's affecting what they doing in society, right? It's affecting what they doing in society. And I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you what, I'm about to do a video on the suicide rate involving ex con it's alarming. It's spiked up tremendously. And I think this shit right here is part of the reason. I think this shit right here is part of the reason. Dudes is using this shit, but you can't really come back. You can't come back from it. It's doing something here. And like I said, I heard people doing using raid, rap, you know, rat uh roach killer or rat poison. They put rat poison in it. And it's just messing people up, bro. And these dudes not coming back. And it's a sad, sad thing, bro. It's a sad, sad thing, bro. You know what I mean? I've seen it so many people. It's just, I mean, actually anybody who's been locked up, man, this is the most terrifying thing. I mean, this is like a hell of a hallucinogen. It's like, man, you just be tripping off of this. You know what I mean? It's a, it's a, it's a world, it's a countrywide, I don't know about worldwide, but the, the, the United States is well aware of this problem. You know what I mean? So, man, kind of, uh, when we talk to your loved ones, man, it take a strong-willed, strong-willed person to move on from this. Sometimes, man, it'd be so bad where they see other people reacting, they don't want to do it no more. You know what I'm saying? So, if you got some people and they acting up, tripping and, and acting up, you know, their character ain't right and all that, man, this could be the problem. You know what I'm saying? And uh, let's try to get them some help the best way we can. You know what I mean? Go ahead and hit that like button. Cash up in the upper left-hand corner. This is Symbolic Mind Generation.